What's up guys, Carly here and today I have a super rad 20 minute jump rope hit workout for you and we are gonna be working our abs, okay? I'm gonna be switching it up every 30 seconds. We're doing eight different ab exercises, hitting all angles and then we're gonna be doing 30 second bursts of jumping rope to burn fat in between each minute, all right? So make sure you guys grab your rope, your mat and get ready to sweat. What's up guys, welcome back. Thanks for joining me on this 20 minute jump rope hit workout for our abs, all right? We are gonna be hitting it from all angles. I have eight different ab exercises for you. We're gonna be switching it up every 30 seconds, which means we have four different blocks, three minutes each. We're gonna be doing two ab exercises for 30 seconds, have a 30 second jump rope, two ab exercises, 30 second jump rope, then a 30 second rest, and we're gonna go on to the next circuit. That's the flow of things. Don't worry, I'm going to lead you through all of this, so just make sure you guys have got your jump rope and a water bottle nearby. I'm gonna be jumping on my gratitude jump rope mat as well as my gratitude jump ropes. I will be switching it up between our freestyle rope right here and then our half pound rope as well if you guys have weighted jump ropes definitely use them in the mix it's always great to switch up your resistance and your routine so your body will work harder and you'll get faster results all right guys we're gonna start off right now with a one minute warm-up we're gonna just do some air squats real quick we're gonna have our feet slightly wider than hip width apart we're gonna sink down putting the weight in our heels and squeezing on their way up okay just like you are sitting down in a chair all right, 15 more seconds of here, then we're gonna do some walkouts. So for those of you new to my channel, thanks for joining me. I've been jumping rope for about 30 years, and I've been doing fitness for a good five years. So if you're ever looking for any tutorials or workouts, check out the rest of them on my channel. Appreciate your support. All right, guys, we're gonna be walking out now, okay? We're gonna go walk straight out into a plank position. If you wanna add a push-up for a challenge, do so, and right back up again, okay? We're gonna go straight into our first 30 second ab exercise, which is going to be on our back, and we're gonna do leg lowers, okay? I'll show you modifications for both. Last one. All right, let's get into our ab position. We're gonna be on our back. All right, I'm gonna be at an angle right here so you can see me. All right, and we are just gonna lower our legs down, and then right back up again, okay? Try not to arch your back. Really try to pull from your lower abs right here and back up again. The farther our ankles are away from us, the harder it's gonna be. So keep this for a second. This is too much, you can bend your legs, lightly tap, and right back up again, okay? So if you wanna challenge, strain your legs. All right, next we're going to move to side to side leg lowers, okay? You're gonna put your arms out in a T, and we're gonna go over to the left and to the right for 30 seconds. Ready, go. Now, the challenge is to try to keep your hips on the floor the entire time, okay? If you're twisting your hips too much, you're taking the exercise out of your abs, all right? The challenge is trying to keep them glued to the mat. All right, we're gonna go side to side, just like this. Keep going, we have eight seconds left. Then we're gonna get up and we're gonna jump rope for 30 seconds and then repeat these two exercises. All right, grab your rope, we're going up. 30 seconds. Starts in five seconds, all right? We're just gonna do the basic bounce, two feet together, ready, go. Or if alternating foot's better for you, right, left, right, left, you do that. But right here, this is our cardio. This is the time to burn fat so we can see all the work we're doing with our abs, okay? So we wanna keep this short and fast, okay? Try to make it as, as intense as possible. Now, for jump rope form, you wanna make sure that your knees are slightly bent, you're jumping on the balls of your feet, your uh, wrists are gonna be somewhere around your hip area. And don't jump more than one two inches off the ground. All right, 10 seconds here. Let's get back up. We're gonna repeat those two ab exercises. All right, so we're on our back. We're just lowering down and back up again, okay? You wanna keep this slow and controlled, all right? Really put that mind to muscle and imagine your abs holding up your legs, okay? We want to do this slow so we don't have any momentum, all right? We want it strictly to be from our abs. 10 seconds left. All right, 10 second rest here, or if you're feeling it, keep going. We're gonna put our arms out in a T position and we're going to go to the right and to the left, okay? Your feet are gonna be straight. 
Here we go, to the right. Slowly over to the left. Again, you wanna to try to keep your hips on the ground the whole time. Really pull from the lower abs right here. You can also feel it right here in your obliques. Woo. Keep it going, seven seconds left. Then we're gonna be up for our 30 second jump rope. All right, grab your rope. We're heading up. Now, if you need to switch out the weight in your rope to make it a little bit heavier, do that right now. And go. Okay, I'm gonna do alternate foot right here, right, left, right, left. Just go super fast, and then we have a 30 second break after this, guys. And then we're gonna start a new set of ab exercises. We're gonna try to keep our heart rate up almost the entire time. It's only about an 18 minute ab work. Three, two, one. All right, 30 seconds, grab a drink of water and I'll meet you back on the mat. All right, three seconds left. Two, one, we're gonna get in a high plank position, okay? Here we go, we're gonna have shoulders in line with wrists, and we're gonna do a plank shoulder tap. So we're gonna tap to our right, to our left. Now, you really wanna squeeze your glutes, engage your core by trying not to go back and forth, okay? You wanna keep your hips as still as possible. That's where the work comes in, okay? If you need to have a wider stance to make it easier, you can spread your legs out. Harder is gonna have them closer together, okay? And do not wiggle your hips. Three seconds, two, one. All right, now we're gonna do rainbows or we're just gonna do side to side in a plank. So I like to do this on my elbows. I'm gonna get in the elbow plank right here. My hands are gonna be like a railroad track, all right? And I'm just gonna be going on my tiptoes, going to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. Now this might be hard for you, for some of you to hold it for 30 seconds. If you need to break it for a second, bend your knees, take a deep breath and get back up again, okay? We only have 13 seconds left. Keep going. Five seconds, hold it. Three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna go back up to jump rope. I'm gonna move my mat this way so it doesn't get caught. Grab my rope. All right, here we go, as fast as we can. For those of you that want a challenge, you can always do double unders. You wanna add the intensity. 30 seconds or high knees, okay? That will get your heart rate up. Or just go speed, as fast as you can. Two feet together, I'll shake foot. Just move. 10 seconds, then we're gonna repeat those two ab, ab exercises again. Three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna go back on the mat. We're gonna get in a high plank position. We're gonna do plank shoulder taps, okay? So remember, shoulders aligned with wrists. We're alternating tapping to the right, to the left. Trying to keep our hips still. No going back and forth. Keep it going. 20 seconds. Three. One, okay, now we're gonna get down to our elbow plank. Our arms are gonna be like railroad tracks, right down here. And go, side to side, right, left. You're on the balls of your feet right here. Keep it going, 10 seconds left. Three, two, one. All right, grab your rope. We're gonna be back up for jumping rope. And that's gonna end our second set right here, okay? We're almost halfway through. Woo, I'm out of breath. Three, two, one. 30 seconds, jump rope. You can 
add in tricks, whatever you like. If you want to learn some tricks, check out my other tutorials. I break it down from beginner, intermediate to advanced. Okay, five seconds, and we're gonna have a 30 second rest. Three, two, one. All right, guys, 30 seconds. All right guys, five seconds left. Go ahead and get on your back. We're gonna be starting with V-ups. All right guys, we're gonna be laying straight out. We're gonna have our body extended, hands over our head, and we're gonna reach straight up, touch our toes as a V, and come right back down again. If that's too much, you can bend your knees and kind of do a crunch in, but if you want the challenge, go straight up in a V, try to touch your toes, and back down again. You wanna to try to keep this slow and controlled, okay? All right, last one, three, two, one. Okay, now we have 10 seconds. We're gonna be doing bicycles, okay? So, you're gonna have your fingertips lightly on the back of your head. We're gonna be alternating opposite elbow, opposite knee, and alternating, okay? Ready, set, go. So, we wanna try to keep our feet off the ground the entire time, and we're twisting, okay? You aren't pulling your head. Your fingertips are lightly on the back of your head, and we are twisting to the left, to the right, okay? Keep it going. And three, two, one. Okay, 10 seconds. Now we're gonna jump rope. So grab your rope. I'm gonna switch my mat the long way so my rope doesn't get caught. And here we go, 30 seconds. and burn those calories so we build our muscle during the ab exercises. Five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, guys, our last 30 second rest. We go on to our last block. You got this. All right guys, five seconds left. We're gonna head down on our mat for our last set of ab exercises. So go ahead and get on your back. All right, we're on our back and we're gonna be doing scissors, okay? So you are going to bring your legs up a tiny bit and we're going to try to keep them as close as we can to the ground and we are gonna be going scissors. So we're gonna cross our legs over the right, over the left, just like this, okay? The harder it is, the closer to the ground, the easier it is, it's gonna be up higher, okay? So you do you, but please make sure you're challenging yourself, all right? the only way you're gonna get results. So right now I'm just hovering right over the ground. We have four seconds left. Three, two, one. Okay, we have a 10 second rest, and then we're gonna do almost the same thing, but we're gonna be doing flutter kicks, okay? So instead of crossing them, we're gonna be going up, down, up, down, okay? Ready, go. So again, the hardest part is going to be keeping it closer to the ground, and then easier is gonna be going up, okay? If you wanna do it down and then up again, you can do it like this or just keep it a challenge all the way down. But we really wanna try not to arch our back the entire time, okay? We wanna feel it right here in the lower abs. All right, 10 seconds, keep it going. Three, two, one. All right guys, we're gonna pick it up. We are gonna do a 30 second jump. Get ready, I move my mat, five seconds. Grab your ropes, 30 seconds to last jump, and we are done with this workout. Ready, go. 30 seconds here. Again, you can do whatever you want. You want to add in some side swings, side swing crosses, crisscrosses, stay in the cross, double unders, whatever you want. All 
All right, 10 seconds. Two, one. All right, 10 seconds. We're gonna repeat those same ab exercises right there. Really working on our lower abs, challenging ourselves to keep our feet closer to the ground. Here we go. Scissors. So I just have my hands right below me by my butt, but if you want, if you have some lower back issues, you can kind of make like a triangle and sit on your hands. Sometimes that feels better. You do you. I know in bar class and Pilates, we do this a lot. We put the triangle and sit on it underneath. Okay, four seconds left. All right, 10 second rest or just keep going if you want the challenge. In five seconds, take a deep breath. And here we go. We're gonna be doing flutters, go. If this is too hard, you can bring it up and then bring it back down again for a challenge. See how long you can handle it here. Bring it up or just stay here. All right, guys, eight seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, guys, we have our last 30 seconds right here. All right, so give it your all. It's our last burn. Okay, ready, go. Remember, high knees, if you can't do double unders, is a good way to burn extra calories or adding a way to jump rope. Whoops. If you trip, you just keep going again. Do some cross legs. Also go to side straddle. 10 seconds, keep going. Three, two, one. All right, guys, Woo, that was good. So if you have some extra time, definitely do some stretches. I have a great video over here of how to stretch out our calf muscles. Especially if you're new to jumping rope, you want to make sure that you are stretching before and after. All right, guys, thanks for joining me. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. If there's anything else you'd like to see, let me know. I get back to each and every one of you. All right, guys, have a great day. Thanks. Peace.